today's boiler tip, we're going to talk about hot torquing a sight glass. Sometimes you'll upgrade your sight glass to a heavy duty model because you're tired of having leaks and cracks and problems with a cheaper sight glass assembly. But an important step for success in an armored sight glass is to hot torque the bolts. This is about the only thing that I used a torque wrench for in my boiler career, but it's very important that we tighten these bolts to a specific torque spec. The sight glass bolt should be torqued before installation, but once we've installed it and put the unit online, we need to retorque it once it's hot. So for safety's sake, I need to isolate this from the pressure of the system. It'll still be hot. So I want to isolate the water connection first, then the steam connection, and then open the drain. The torque spec for these bolts is located on the side label here, and it's 32 PSI. So that torque setting is important to have correct on the wrench. But secondly, also the order that we torque is important. We always want to torque from inside to outside so that we don't capture or trap a bow in the glass. When I valve this back in, I want to valve the steam on first, then the water, and then I can close that valve and let it pressurize. So the reason that we want to do this is to ensure that we've got good compression of the gasket and that the pressure is evenly distributed across the glass so that we don't get stress and breakage. 